Okay, so let's solve this problem. So find the standard equation of the hyperbola that satisfies the given conditions. So we have this given vertices and focus. But first, we need to graph this hyperbola for us to know the formula we're going to use to solve for the standard equation. So from the given vertices, this one is x and this one is y. So x is positive 5, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then y, that's negative 4. So negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, then negative 4. So this is now the first coordinate of the vertex. And the second one, this is x and y, so x is negative 1 and y is negative 4. So this is the coordinate of the second vertex. Then from the given focus, this one is x and y. So x is positive 7, positive 6, positive 7. So this is now the coordinate of the focus. Then observe that in the graph, the position of the vertex is in horizontal form. So since the vertex is in horizontal form, so therefore, this hyperbola is in horizontal position and the formula for the horizontal hyperbola that's x minus h then to the power 2 over a squared then minus y minus k to the power 2 over b squared then equals 1 then to solve for the center since we can find the center using the midpoint of these vertices, so from the given two vertex, from this point to this point, we just need to locate the center. So first, we need to find the distance between these two vertices. So uh, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, since the distance between these two vertices is 6, then divide this one by 2 to find the center, so we have 3. So therefore, we need to count 3 for the center, so we have 1, 2, 3, and this is now the center of this hyperbola. Then to find out the coordinates of the center, so this is uh, positive 2. And this one is negative 4. So center is x, that's positive 2. And y, that's negative 4. So since center is 2 and negative 4, so h now is positive 2. And k is negative 4. Then to solve for uh, a, since a, that's... Uh, center to vertex so from center to vertex so a is 1 to 3 so a is equal to 3 then for b that center to covertex since there's no given covertex so therefore we cannot solve b using the given but we need to solve c to solve for B, since C is center to focus, so from center to focus, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, so therefore C is equal to 5. Since we have now the values of A and C, so we can solve now B using this formula that c squared is equal to a squared plus b squared then substitute now the values so we have c this one is 5 squared equals a 3 squared plus b squared then 5 squared is 25 equals 3 squared this one is 9 then plus b squared then 25 transpose minus 9 equals b squared. Then 25 minus 9, this one is 16. Equals b squared, then take the square root to solve for b. 
square root of 16, this one is positive 4. So since we have now uh, the four values, the H, the K, A, and B, so we can solve now the standard equation of this hyperbola using this formula. So we have X minus H, since H is positive 2, so therefore minus 2 then to the power 2 over A squared, that's 3, to the power 2. Then minus y minus k, since k is negative 4, so therefore, plus 4 then to the power 2 over b squared and b, that's equal to 4 then to the power 2 equals 1. Then simplify, so we have now x minus 2 to the power 2 over 3 squared, this one is 9. Then minus y plus 4 to the power 2 over 4 squared, this one is 16, then equals 1. So this is now the standard equation of this hyperbola.